Y'all, I'm headed to the expo. This is what I got on. Like right now, I'm actually like working with my producers. Um, that's actually like, yeah, I'm excited. I can't even believe it, y'all. It's kind of crazy. I just literally like been like persistent with it and like kept going and it really takes shape. What song? Don't be so hard on yourself because I felt like even for myself, it's like, okay, this isn't good enough. This isn't that. And it's like I'm giving myself like words that's putting me down. And I, I you know, sometimes I kind of still do it, but I've been like getting myself from, from doing that. So just like tell yourself like positive things, like meditate, you know, um, take trips, like take a little vacation, take your like one day off out the week and just really like focus on yourself. Outside of you working and you said you meditate, what do you do to feel, to have your little vacation at home to get away? I just go to the studio. <laughs> Go to the studio. No, I go to the studio and I um then I'll go get like massages and things like that. And um just kinda like you know what I do when I really want to relax? I really I take naps. I don't know. And then I just get sleep. Like that's really like like key too. Like because a lot of times we think that we need to do things 24-7. It doesn't work like that. You have to like get sleep and rest and like stay hydrated and all that good stuff. I hope that helps. <laughs> It does, because someone out there, they've been burning themselves out. So yes, you can't burn yourself out because you get all So this is your reminder, this is your sign that you need to take your behind a nap. Sincerely from Black yeah. China. <laughs> well, ladies and gentlemen, please make some noise for Miss Black China. Thank you, guys. with an inspiring keynote address. Don't miss Toya next on the main stage. I interviewed you too back then and since then we right back here. So right back here. make some noise for the Houston Women's Expo. <laughs> now, Toya, be so before we came here, I was on TikTok, and I saw your girls on there <laughs> dancing. Oh boy, they got my little one on TikTok. Oh my goodness. Tell us how motherhood is in, you know, my, my team, my support system, doing what they do, but I basically was told that you made your bed hard, you gonna lay in it. So I had to figure it out. So I, I really learned a whole lot about motherhood with Regine. So this time around, I wouldn't say it was easier because that was 20 years ago. I'm like, how did you have, how do you have a 20 year gap? But it worked out to say I have a 20 year gap. My kids are extremely close. Um, you know, I love my babies, that's my heart. But I will say this, you know, motherhood is not easy for those of you who have have kids. Like, you know, being a parent is not easy, but one thing about it, we love our babies and we give them all we got. And we super women, we do it, we get the job done. Now with, with that 20 year gap, is Regine more like a big sister or like a second mom? Oh boy, I know y'all see me share videos all the time about when I leave my kid with Regine. It's like the young hip sister that, you know, and I'm trying to raise rain, you know, a different kind of way. But in this, this day and time, kids are exposed to so much. They're exposed to so much. So she'll be with her sister and she she looks up to her. Like it's like Regine's like the cool big sister and she wants to do all of these TikTok videos and do stuff that Nene do. So I'm like, you have to set a positive example and be a good big sister so she can, you know, have a positive way to grab the people in to get them to support whatever it is you're selling or whatever it is that you believe in. That, that don't mean you have to hate on your sister that seem to have the recipe and it's working for her, but it might not be working for you because that's not your calling. That's not what you're supposed to be doing. Find what you're supposed to be doing and put your energy into that and be happy that your sister is elevating and going to the top. It might not be your season. It's your, your sister season now, but that don't mean your season is not coming. Amen. So just 
stay on it. Like, don't give up, don't stop. Like, I have my moments. I'm not, you know, I go through my ups and down times, but it, do, it does not stop me from going. It's like, that. okay, I'm going to try that. That didn't work. I'm going to try that. Like, I'm not going to give up. And then some stuff hit, some stuff don't. But that don't mean stop. But guess what? I'm surrounded around plenty when I tell you plenty of successful women that are killing it out here. And you know what? That motivate me yep. to even want to go harder. I'm happy. I'm cheering my sister on along the way. I love Bear with me, okay? This is a steam technology. So it's not hot? Well, it's steam. It's definitely well, yeah. not hot as a flat out. This guy will never hurt your brains, will never burn you on my nose. It's on all day, yet it doesn't burn. From wet hair, the craziest curls in the world. There is nothing more curly than this. From the roots. Yeah. And if it burns you, you smack uh, me, all right? All right, yeah, don't my ear <laughs> oh my <God. laughs> now this is no, really wet so we're gonna breathe and we're gonna do it nice and slow the skin technology relax your hair from the inside out so all you need is one motion and then you're gonna touch your hair and you're gonna realize that not only that it's straight certain something's right now remember how i told you one time it's enough yeah. your hair is soaking wet so we're gonna do that twice Two times, touch your hair, not that hot, yeah. something smooth and straight. That's the key that nice. it doesn't get hot. Yeah. I'll curl it back again. So you curl, don't you don't have to worry about it. Well, one day you wear it straight uh -huh. and everybody be like, oh my god. And yeah. the second day you do that. Uh-huh. Straight and then curl with one hand. And we have, check this out, the black Shakira. <laughs> oh, that is, that's actually cute. Hell yeah, I am. Such a beautiful figure, all of you. <laughs> it's cute. And we curl it, I'm one hand, my hair one day. Well, and you go with me. Three, two, one. Chiquira, chiquira. Oh, Ooh, baby, cute. You look like this. <laughs> it's really cute though. Yes, you have yeah. such a good hair. Thank you. Actually cute. I think I'm gonna straighten my hair out, y'all. Put some curls in it. Yeah. I'm gonna straighten it and curl it. <laughs> I'm leaving the women expo. Y'all had a good time. So much fun, y'all. <laughs> Thanks. So much fun. Wrap it up. Whoa. They're all jeans. Yeah, I had fun, y'all. Latoya Luckett. I mean, I said Latoya. Latoya, I met her. Like China. Y'all. It was lit. Okay, now I'm about to walk to my car. And I don't know, I, I gotta walk like, probably like five minutes, or probably even more than that, I'll be 